Hello everyone, this is Lillian and it's time for our three minutes with the word audio devotional. Today's topic is fear not and our anchor scripture is taken from the book of Isaiah chapter 41 and verse 10. Fear not for I am with you. Be not dismayed for I am your God. I will strengthen you. Yes, I will help you. I will uphold you with my righteous right hand. One of my sons is very afraid of the dark. He's so spooked out about being in the dark that there must always be a light turned on somewhere visible all through the night. There are nights when I insist that the lights must go out. On such nights, I find that once he calls out to me and I answer, he has his peace and he can go back to sleep. I don't know what makes him afraid of the dark. Maybe images form in his head or just the feeling of not seeing everything going on. I'm not sure. What I am sure about is this. The minute he hears my voice or knows that I am nearby in the room, the fear dissipates and he sleeps. As I prepared for today's episode, this whole scenario played out in my mind again. The scripture says, do not be afraid. Why? Because I am with you. Every time the Bible used the words fear not or do not be afraid, you will notice that there were things that should ordinarily cause the people being spoken to to fear. So today God is speaking to someone who is face to face with a situation that should ordinarily cause them to fear. A situation that you have no idea how to solve. God is saying to you, I am with you. We see that I am again. I am is with you. To the one who is afraid of the diagnosis that has come, he says, I am healer. To the one of afraid of uncertainty surrounding them, he says, I am all-knowing. To the one afraid because of the loss of a job, he says, I am provision. To the one afraid of the threats coming from all around, he says, I am defender. I am. He is, I am. He is. He can be absolutely anything. This morning he's saying to you, even though there is reason to fear, do not fear for I am with you. Just like my son relaxes once he knows I am around him, even when the things that scared him in the first place haven't gone away. Let the knowledge that I am is with you give you courage to walk through your storms. Let your testimony be, the Lord is my light and my salvation. Whom shall I fear? Let us pray. Father in heaven, thank you so much for your word this morning. Thank you so much for being present with us through the storms we face. Please continue to take all the glory, almighty God. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. Speak to you again soon. If you are blessed, please drop me a line on audiodevotional at yahoo.com or on our website at www.3minutesaudiodevotional.com. You could also follow us on Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, and Twitter at 3 Minutes Audio Devotional. Remember, Wrapped up in God's word is all you need for your change to come. Love you and bye.